Third word is Prahlada Ahlada. Two words we have discussed. Namaste Narasrinhaya Prahlada Ahlada Dayene. What is the meaning of Prahlada Ahlada? Prahlad is the name of Prahlad. Ahlada means joy. And Dayene means one who gives. Who gives joy. Ahlad to Prahlad. And uh, what is the opposite of joy, happiness, and sorrow, grief? So when we are not happy, when we are fearful, we cannot understand the science of God. In order to understand the science of God, you must be fearless. In order to know Krishna, in order to know the the the, the understand Krishna, the knowledge of God, the scientific knowledge of God, you must be fearless and you must be joyful. Okay. And that is given in Srimad Bhagavatam, 1st Kanto, 2nd chapter, 20 verse. Please recite with me. Bhagavat Tatta Vijyanam Mukta Sangasya Jayate a little loudly so that Rasinga did hear from Rasinga Bhutta. It's quite far and your voice is very feeble. Weak. It finished on the way. Try to reach Rasinga Deep. Bhagavad Tata Vigyanam Mukta Sangaisha Jayate One become fearless. You want to be become fearless? Or you want to be fearful? You want to be happy or unhappy? Happy. happy. Fearful or fearless? Fearless. Good. So you become fearless. You become joyful by practicing Bhagavad Bhakti Yoga. And what is Bhagavad Bhakti Yoga? By contact with devotional service of the Lord, you get all the positive scientific knowledge of Krishna. And your this life, it is only possible with this human form of life. Bhagavad Gita 7, chapter 3rd Shloka. Manushyanam sahasresu Kachit yatati siddhaye Yatitam api siddhanam Tasmin man vyakti tatkata Manushyanam Out of Manishanam Sahasrish, out of thousands and thousands and thousands of human beings, Kachit, sometimes, Yatati, if they try, Siddhaye, to get liberation, Yatatam Api Siddhanam Kasmin Mang Yaptito. You may get liberation after lots of penance and austerity, but to know Krishna is not that easy. One who knows Krishna is very few. Very few. And one who knows Krishna in Bhagavata, he is known as what? Mahatma. Mahatma. One who knows Krishna, Krishna himself declares as he is Mahatma. He is not Atma. He is elevated soul. He is elevated And uh, oh, so we are discussing about Prahlad or Ahlad or Daini. Prahlad is happy. And this happiness is given by nursing the Deva. Nursing God again gave happiness to everybody and he is father of everybody. He always, always gives happiness to everybody, even in the form of nursing the Deva. But we are not qualified. Others are not qualified to receive the happiness from but to think of the ordinary living entity. Even Brahma himself is afraid. Because when this roaring lion, half lion, half man comes out from the lion, from the spiller, then Brahma is afraid in Brahma Loka, in the planet of Brahma. He asks his officers, see, see, go outside. Is there any class between the two planets and make a big sound, collision? Or is it the time of any elation? And Brahma then comes to this, uh, you know, South India. 
look to nursing the diva and see the nursing board is there, the angry nursing board is still roaring. Mm. The fighting is going on, you know. He's all his dancing hairs, uh, smiling little Prahlad. <laughs> Very sweet. The angry father, uh, depressed father. At the time he's depressed. Because by this time all his fighter plans and all his soldiers lost their life. He's depressed because he knows his day is coming. Then Indra, he's also afraid. Why is he afraid? You say, except Prahlad Maharaj, all are afraid. That's why Prahlad Ahlada died. Prahlad is only getting happiness and joy from Rasim. We have already discussed that Indra. Indra once happens, what happened? There is a fight between Indra and Hiranyakashipu. And Indra aimed his thunderbolt, thunderbolt to Hiranyakashipu. Just simply throw it and it's a finish. This Hiranyakashipu will be no more. But Hiranyakashipu open like this. Okay, let it come. And it hit his chest. And his chest is more than a rock. Even the thunderbolt of Indra fail, then Indra become fearful. Oh, very powerful. And when our beloved Nasinga Dev simply torn the chest of Hiranyakasipu, then Indra's condition, you think, what happened? Very fearful. That my Lord who torn the heart of the stone like heart of Sila Tanka, heart of whom Rinda Prasipu must be very angry. So my father is angry. How can I be happy? How can I be happy? That is why Indra is fearful. And when Indra is fearful, his all officers are fearful. He is the king of demigods. He is the head of the 33 courts of demigods. And once you know, as it is Sohimaranai, so he will Once he is angry, once he is fearful, his all of his hearts are fearful. That is why Indra is fearful, all demigods are fearful, the Rishis are fearful, the forefathers are fearful, the Apsaras are fearful, the Gandharvas are fearful, all are fearful except Prada. Prada is simply smiling, which is the garland in the hand that he is going to welcome who? Father. Supreme Father. Father, I am waiting. Finish your drama. <laughs> I will felicitate you. That's a nice word. Others are fearing. Lakshmi Devi, you know the whole story. Uh, everybody requests Lakshmi Devi. You are the wife of uh, Nasinga Devi. Please go and please him. Lakshmi also try but fail. Everybody fail. Who is successful? Prahlad. Why is successful? Because he is devotee. And what type of devotee? He is a devotee by heart. Personal devotee. No fear. That is the quality of devotee. Devotees are fearless, always joyful. So, Prahlad is happy. There are two reasons to be happy because Krishna himself gives the darshan of Prahlad Maharaj. Person to Prahlad Maharaj and at the same time finish his unwanted father. Third, he also delivered 21 generations of Prahlad Maharaj. That is why Prahlad is Ahlad. That is why Prahlad is happy. That is why Prahlad is joyful. It is not that because Krishna killed his father, Krishna gave his everything to Prahlada, but simply because Krishna take all the pains to come from Golak Vrindavan to the South India, our beloved Prahlad become grateful. They are not like us, ungrateful. We are very ungrateful. Don't mind. Krishna is giving everything. And we foolish, we ungrateful people not even come in a week to Krishna to pay the gratitude. Why we are coming to Sunday temple? To eat? No. To show our gratitude. Krishna, I don't know. I am not qualified. How you make me this whole week happy? That is why we came to Krishna. We come to Krishna, Rupini Krishna, to say thank you. Grateful. We are grateful. You give such a good father, 
such a good mother, such a good husband, such a good children, such a good boyfriend, such a good girlfriend, or such a good environment. And if not such a good me, I'm too good always. <laughs> and how you sanction me to come to your temple, I'm not qualified. So I must be grateful. I must be grateful. So coming to temple is a token to show gratitude. So in that sense, Prahlad is so grateful. I don't know. Why you come to me? I should go to you back to Godhead. Never write like back Godhead to us. What a cynical is there somewhere written that Krishna, please come, uh, come here and take me back? No. We say back to God, then we will go there. Please qualify me to go back to God. So, in that sense, Prahlad Maharaj is very happy. Very happy. That is the meaning of Prahlad Maharaj. Let's stop. Very good.